Hi, my name is Pixel Mist, and you're doing right uh, by watching this video because you need to learn how to use the tool before using it. So, uh, I'm going to teach you right now how to use the Craft Maker. Uh, I want you to go from the left to the right uh, to make sure you didn't forget uh, anything. So, uh, if you forgot something, after you watch the video and you don't want to rewatch it, you just press on any text and it will tell you what exactly it does. Okay? Just like that. It gives you hints. So, my craft class name is basically a craft class name that is inside of the code that you have created. Nobody will see that. So, you can just name it as my new craft, my, yeah, my new craft, whatever. Action description. It's what player sees when he uh, does the craft. For example, make a bone knife, right? So, and crafting time, um, it's basically the crafting time. Zero means instant, five means long. This is not seconds, this is animations. They take longer than one second to perform. So usually I use two. This is the, the most common time in the distant loan to craft something, I believe. XP per craft. If we perform this craft right now, right now, we are going to have 67% of fine work. If we put it to minus one, we're going to have the maximum level of fine work we can have. Okay, let's go further. Ingredient number zero. Zero, not one, zero. In code, in every single game, everywhere, in computers, the count starts with a zero. And I want you to count with a zero because uh, later it's going to help you. Uh, so ingredient class names. For example, let's craft something by using a kitchen knife kitchen knife and the amount is basically the amount if we put nails over here and put it to the 10 we're going to lose 10 nails upon the craft the little ingredient of the craft of course it's true but if we are using a kitchen knife i'm just going to name it as knife uh and we make it as false and we allow health edit and we subtract health we are going to have a badly damaged knife after it. If you want to repair it, just add it over here to the 50, okay? But basically it's made to subtract, so uh, it's not the right way how do you fix the items. Okay, let's go further. Ingredient number one is basically the same thing, but another item that you need to combine with your knife. Let's make it as binoculars or something else. There is a website, it's old. I mean, on the GitHub, you can have almost any class name that you have inside of the game. But not all of them, of course, because it's old, it's 2020. But let's use Blaze, for example. And we put Blaze over here. So when we combine knife with Blaze, um, we are going to craft Mm, barbed wire, okay, for example, and press it, uh, just drop it over here. Uh, yeah, so spawn full, for example, water in the bottle. If we, instead of barbed wire, create a, I mean, craft the water bottle and press true over here, our water bottle is going to be full. How much items will be crafted? Uh, for example, one barbed wire or 100 barbed wires, okay? But don't make it that big. That's made for rounds, for ammunition and everything like that, not for ordinary items. That's level of fine work. If you have high level of fine, you have a chance to craft not one, what barbed wire, but for example, two of them. Inherit health. Now, this is interesting. 
you have three options over here. The most simple one is turn off. This is basically what people usually use. That means that your barbed wire, okay, let me rename it to the knife, okay? It's hard to me to, for the, it's hard for me to pronounce. Your knife is going to be crafted pristine always when it's turned off. No matter if your first knife or blades are badly damaged. If you choose all, it's going to take a look at how much health it has inside of this knife and how much health it has inside of blades and determine how much health your crafted knife will have. So, for example, if your, um, let me use a tire, okay? If your tire is badly damaged and your blaze is pristine, in that case, your knife is going to be either just damaged or worn. Uh, inherit health chosen. From which? From first ingredient. That means that if your tire is badly damaged, but your blaze is worn, your knife is going to be worn, okay? Transfer attachments. If we turn it on and press it either to zero or one, it's going to take attachment from that item and put it inside of the crafted item. But that works, for example, with um, backpacks. If you craft uh, a new backpack from uh, another backpack, like upgrading stuff, it's going to transfer items like that from a zero. Um, yeah, and that's it. You have done everything. You have a craft right now. Um, and to make it work, you need to make your own mod. Don't worry. Uh, I got you. I, I, I've got you, right? So uh, what you need to do is you need to press video tutorial over here. And then after that, I want you, sorry, I want you to go inside of the description over here. You're going to have your own video on English, don't worry. Uh, and download from my Google uh, this my server folder. I have already downloaded, so you don't need to wait. What you do, you go to the P drive and you just open it, open this folder. And you drag and drop it over here. After that, you're going to have something like this, like this. So, what you do next is you go in, you need to go inside of the scripts for world, my new craft over here. I'm going to delete everything because this is example crafts. And what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go to the craft maker and press copy craft copy it craft, and I'm going to paste it over here. After that, I'm going to press enter one, one more time, going back to the craft maker and press copy registration, copy, uh, we have copied it, and we paste it over here, okay? That's it, basically, how it works. Uh, now, we need to save it. Uh, and I'm going to tell you another thing, very important, is as you can see, I have two lines that are exactly the same. That can happen, don't worry. Now, right now it's happening because I'm using Craftmaker DZ that I haven't yet uh, updated. And that's why the copy registration button is not really working. But once you are watching this video, it's going to work, don't worry. For example, if I'm going to show you right now uh, another version of this website, which is in Russian because it's a test version and I'm Russian and I'm going to press the copy registration here. Now it's going to work. As you can see, the registration is copied. So it's working, don't worry. If it's not copying, just 
try to click one more time. Not copying again, write to me, don't be shy, uh, and everything like that. I'm here to help. So once you have done this, you press save. Your, you need to save your craft. And uh, that's it, basically. You need to pack your My Server, just pack it, and you're done. That's how easy it is. And for example, I don't want to spend much of your time and much of my time, uh, but just yeah, to yeah. make it ob uh, to show you how easy it is to cre to create something. I'm going to show you the Russian example right now. So it's nine, I mean, yeah, nine, nine minutes. And we're going to finish in three minutes. And I'm explaining at the same time, okay? So it takes three minutes to create something with explanation. And by the like ratio, you can see how people like it and those those are russians so this is not a popular thing they were testing it and we if we go to the comment section they are all amazed by it okay so let's take a look what i do here is i am basically changing the class names changing the how do i uh, what the craft should be <clears throat> After that, I'm going to the my new craft. I'm pasting the copied craft, pasting the copied registration for the for the craft. After that, I'm packing the mod, and uh, I'm gonna just a little bit further. I run the game with mod installed, of course, and as we can see. The craft bear pelt plus binoculars are going to spawn something. I don't remember what. It's working. Yeah, Instacraft, and we have our blood test kit. That's easy. Uh, I mean, that's how easy it is. But very important thing. I hope that you have watched the till this moment so you're gonna hear it not all items are suitable for crafting i don't know why for some reason some items don't like to be combined with each other so if it if your craft is not working but you're completely sure that you have done everything right just choose another recipe okay mm. This is the only way I can help you with that. So thank you for your attention. You can go now and try again. Uh, I mean, not try again, try create your own craft. But for those who want to listen, I'm going to repeat what we have done here one more time. Uh, we have entered, uh, typed in the craft class name, Action description is what player sees, crafting time, how long is it going to take uh, time, XP craft, fine work, rough work, ingredient, class name, what we have uh, as a class name inside of the admin tools. Uh, same thing with the second ingredient, I mean ingredient number one actually. Um, properties over here, result class name, uh, how much items, the type of health, copy craft, copy registration, put it right inside of my server scripts for the world, my new craft, put it over here, save, pack, you're done. That's how easy it is. You basically cannot do it much more easier. I've done everything for you, even the mod itself. If you want to rename or something with my server, just go inside of this config and replace my server everywhere with um, any other name that you want to use, okay? 
that's how easy it is. Thank you for your attention. Um, yeah, good luck.